Welcome back to Good Day State Line. It's Tuesday, Trends Day, and tonight we are diving into this super cute box from Sweetology with my lovely assistants, Shannon and Sydney, on Superhero Day. So we got Wonder Woman and all of the Marvel characters rolled into one t-shirt and Catwoman. So we are ready to take on this challenge. Sweetology, is, it's very cute, right? We just took the box apart because that would have taken the entire time yeah, <laughs> for no you to enjoy us decorating. Um, but it's really cute. Um, it's this idea where you can um, decorate cakes or cupcakes or cookies or they even have like gingerbread houses and you get everything that you need and you don't have to bake it yourself which I mean some days I enjoy baking but Sydney you have a small or Sydney <laughs> Shannon you have a small daughter Sydney you have a cat I don't know if you're I, cat. Do, I, have <laughs> two cats. I do cats but they don't <laughs> they enjoy don't cupcakes bake. too much well like my little nieces and nephews like some of them will bake with me but then at some point you're like no can we just decorate yeah yeah so that's kind of where it gets very from. messy with little ones yeah so let's see you guys ready to dive in here's some scissors yes. Um, okay. to start the frosting. They sent us some cupcakes that smell delicious. The cool thing too is it comes um, with ice in the box so it will last a little while and then they also tell you. So we got these like four or five days ago and mm -hmm. I just put them in the fridge and took them out uh, this morning so not bad at all. They give you the opportunity to like freeze for up to three months too and you can just freeze the entire box which is pretty cool. Really cool. Um, you don't have to like take it out because obviously the frosting tips aren't going to go bad in the freezer. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, but it's fun for like a surprise to have, have on hand for like a rainy or a snowy day mm -hmm. or something. Um, or whenever you're trying to you know, have some fun with your kids. They also sent a fancy um, bag, but to do that, I really gotta go like this, all right. So you guys actually like superheroes? Because I don't really know much about them. You I do. actually do like superheroes. Who's your favorite superhero? Um, I think it would have to be Iron Man, and I'm really sad that he's not in the Marvel movies anymore. That's what's his name, right? That Robert is Downey Robert Downey Jr. Jr. Yes, correct. Why is he your favorite? Um, I don't know. He was just the first one that I saw in the movie theater. That's the first um, movie, right? Yeah, yeah, it was the in first like Marvel movie. Yeah. Sydney, what's your favorite superhero? Um, I don't know. I'm really not into superheroes. My my dad is really into Batman. Okay, so. that seems appropriate for dads. So I will go ahead and give a shout out to my dad and say, go Aww. Batman. <laughs> Do you know who I like? I've only seen a few Marvel movies and all out of order. Um, but I like the Hulk, and I like Paul Rudd. Paul Rudd is good. <laughs> so Ant I Man like Paul Rudd, so movie. I like Ant-Man. But I actually think the movie's like funny. It is really like, funny. You don't have to enjoy all the Marvel like it's movies to watch that one. You know, right? and I really didn't want to like Ant-Man, um, and I refused to watch it for the longest time. And when I finally watched it, I was like, why did I ever hate this? See, like, why did I open. just... Oh, I have learned I that. I accidentally just ate some frosting. It was delicious. <laughs> Ooh, it was actually really good. I shouldn't have put the black in here, guys. What's um, what's your favorite kind of Halloween candy, Shannon? Um, so I just recently learned that I am obsessed with hundred grand bars. But what was oh. really funny is I was calling them thousand grand bars last night. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize that it was just a oh, hundred. you learned. Like, yeah. I was this age when I learned. Yep, I was this age when I learned that's a hundred grand bar, not a thousand grand bar. Oh, so. that's, I know those have peanut butter in them, right? No, they're they actually don't? just. They're almost like a crunch bar. Are but it's like, got oh, caramel. I was thinking about take five. It's got caramel and stuff in it too. So it's um, I don't know. They're just really good. Okay, Sydney, what about you? Um, I am. In terms of chocolate, I do love Reese's. Okay. But I have a very special place in my heart for Sour Patch Kids. It's, it's fair. My daughter's fair. like a Sour Patch Kid. I feel <laughs> just her personality. Yeah. <laughs> She's a redhead, so. What uh, what's she dressing up as for Halloween? She has two costumes. So because I'm a crazy mom, I have five. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so she is going to be Bluey, okay. um, but she's I also going to is. be a Woodland Fairy. So what's the Bluey? Bluey it's the Australian. Is, it's dog. an Australian show on Disney Plus, okay. um, and it's just really cute. I mean, it's um, it's like a family of blue healers. There's dogs. Yep, blue healer dogs. Um, and there's four of them, so there's two kids. There's Bingo and Bluey, and then there's also um, Bandit and Chili. The parents are just super relatable, so like all That's of us fun. millennial parents, I think just kind of identify with them. So I wanted to make note in Sweetology, they give you this like teeny tiny little thing with like a cute little heart, but I didn't give it to you guys, I took it. It's like so <laughs> cute, right? It is really cute. Or you can go to Sweetology.com if you want some details, and you can send us your ideas for Tuesday Trends at gds at fox39.com. Send me an email.
anytime. I'll be right back.